Welcome to Broken News Daily, a break from your normal news. A businessman in Great Britain recently turned down a $9.3 million offer to purchase a license plate that says F1. Ufzul Khan purchased the F1 license plate in 2008 for a little over $685,000, which I'm sure at the time seemed obscene, but apparently it's worth 13 and a half times more now. That's appreciating so much faster than gold? This gives me a new business idea. Cash for license plates. Little history behind the F1 plate. The F on the plate means it was registered in Essex County. And the one means, obviously, it was the first car registered in Essex County. Which means the F1 plate was first registered in 1904. Funnily enough, the U.S. purchased the Panama Canal Zone for $10 million in the same year this license plate was registered or roughly $700,000 more than the F1 plate is worth. You shouldn't have turned it down, Ufzul. You could have owned a canal. Ufzul collects license plates and also owns N01, which is either really braggy or really sad, and the royal wedding-themed 4HRH, which means for his royal wedding. Huh, I wouldn't have guessed that. I wonder how much plate OHM55 would be worth, which stands for On Her Majesty's Secret Service. Nobody respects George Lazenby's bond, so probably like a dollar. Ufzul rotates the expensive license plate between his Bugatti Veyron supercar and his Mercedes SKR McLaren, depending on how much he wants people to know how cool and rich he is that day. According to a spokesman for Ufzul, Mr. Khan has no interest in selling F1, which is his favorite plate. Cherished number plates, unlike property or other investments, tend not to fluctuate in value. They only go up. It really shouldn't be a shock to people that the number plate is worth millions. Yeah, I mean, of course. Why would it shock anyone? I mean, license plates are totally a resource that should cost more than priceless works of art, or heck, even most homes. It makes total sense. I'm sorry, guys. You're right. Let's just move along. Nothing to see here. Just a bunch of guys buying and selling totally necessary items. Psych. That's it for today. More broken news coming soon. See you then.